What's going on boys and girls, what's up world, Austin John plays here, and with the release of Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild, the Expansion Pass DLC Pack 2, the Champion's Ballad, full title, they have introduced to you the Royal Guard's armor, and I'm going to show you how you can get it today. Just for the record, this one drove me nuts. It really did. Uh, so for this you need to make your way to the Riverside Stable and then coincidentally the same thing as the horse armor and every other time there's one table and there's a book on the table. This is Super Rumor Mill Volume 4. From the moment I wake to the moment I sleep my mind is full of rumors. You find folks keep up with dream rumors too, don't you? Well, this one's so good, it might as well be a dream. Listen up, history buffs. This tidbit is about the brave soldiers who were tragically wiped out during the Great Calamity. The Royal Guards who protected the Royal Family. Amongst Hyrule soldiers, only the best of the best had the honor of guarding the Royal Family. Apparently, the equipment they wore can still be found somewhere in Hyrule Castle. <sighs> they say a former Maid spoke of the treasure near the dining hall, in the guards chamber, and on the second floor. I do hope one day Hyrule Castle is restored to its former glory complete with royal guards. Huh, I wonder if a royal guard in shining armor is going to sweep me off of my feet. You Probably not. Anyways, make your way inside a Hyrule Castle. Uh, for this, for the first one in the guards chamber, if you're not familiar with the guards chamber, you want to make your way through the beginning entrance. Make your left at the Lazalfo, And then down here in the guards chamber, the treasure chest is just going to kind of be hanging out in the middle of the room. Uh, next to this is Alfo. So if you have Majora's Mask, you're fine. Go ahead, open up that treasure chest, and you're gonna get the boots. These boots are part of the uniform for the High Rules Royal Family. They're a fine blend of style and function. It's a rather rare find. The next one is the dining hall. Uh, to access the dining hall, I recommend going from outside of Hyrule Castle, and then this is right below one of the uh, the guard houses. Inside here, I actually ran into a fun little bug here as I was approaching the dining hall. I froze, all the atmosphere kept going, and then they uh, they spawned into existence. Anyways, it's hidden near the dining hall. Right outside of the dining hall, you have this little corridor. Let's make our way down. And on the left hand side is a bombable wall, you're probably familiar with this because it holds the Royal Guard sword. Now behind the Royal Guard sword, you're going to find the Royal Guard uniform. It's a lightweight material that's both stylish and practical. For your third one, this one actually took me quite a while, it just says on the second floor. Trick is, it's actually on the second floor of the Sanctum. That's the reason it was so vague because they didn't want to say the Sanctum, maybe it wasn't called the Sanctum. Uh, back then it was called like the royal room or something. I don't know. Anyways, climb your way up to the top of the sanctum and then uh, you're going to want to make your way down one of these little holes over here. There's five of them or towers I guess you'd call them. And then you're going to get to the area that is above Ganon. Right here you actually see like the, uh, the little stems that hold his little, I don't know, cocoon up or whatever. Anyways, inside of the room you're going to find here your EX chest number three. Let's head on over here, mosey mosey. Open the chest and that is the Royal Guards cop. This spiffy cop is part of the uniform for the Royal Guards. It's quite spiffy, quite spiffy indeed. Let's put on this cap, let's put on this uniform and these boots. Uh, of course, I recommend some Royal Guards weapons. Uh, you got the claymore, you got the sword. I think the, the sword would look best. The Royal Guards bow and the Royal Guards shield. As you're running around, you're probably going to find these. And boom, EX Royal Guard rumors complete. And that is quite a spiffy uniform. Uh, the thing that I don't think makes a lot of sense is how dark the weapons are. But how bright and vivid the outfit is. I just I just feel like that's a little weird, don't you think? Like, the Royal Guard's outfit probably looks better with, like, the Royal Bow and, like, the regular weapons. Anyways, guys, that is how to get yourself the Royal Guard's armor in Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild DLC Pack to the Champion's Ballad. In just a little bit, I'm going to have your next video as far as how to get the other three remaining items of clothing. Of course, there's always a card in the top right corner. Be sure to click that as well as the card that's appearing on screen right now. Till next time, Austin John out. Be sure to like this video and subscribe. I'm going to be giving you guys lots of helpful videos in the next following days and weeks. 
Until next time, Austin John out. <laughs>